Kathleen here. All right, so I'm starting something called morning meditation, where we get to um, exercise a little bit, and get to read a little bit of meditation, and we get to warm up our body for the day. All right, so let's start. Let's take a little walk and deep walk. Do, 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 do. A little bit. All right, shake ourselves out a little bit. Just getting ourselves all loose and ready for the day. Yay! But it's important to have a lot of oxygen to start your day off right. So let's take some deep breaths, okay? Inhale. And exhale. Inhale again. Exhale. Inhale again. So it's actually good to pause a little bit after you inhale to exhale. I'm not sure why, but it helps to relax you. All right, so today we're going to be thinking happy thoughts. We're going to be thinking positively about ourselves, about other people, about the world, about God. Start our day off. All right, so let's start. I'm going to read some meditations as we gently, gently walk in place. Um, if you don't feel like walking, you can do something else. You can Stretch, stretch. Just a walk. It's a gentle walk, just to, you know, get yourself ready, just to wake up your brain, wake up your muscles. Starting a happy day today. All right. So, this meditation is from Marcus Aurelius, was a Roman emperor and a Stoic philosopher. All right. Let's start reading. When you wake up in the morning, tell yourself. The people I deal with today will be meddling, ungrateful, arrogant, dishonest, jealous, and surly. They are like this because they can't tell good from evil. But I, we, have seen the beauty of good and the ugliness of evil and have recognized that the wrongdoer has a nature related to my own, not of the same blood or birth, but the same mind and possessing a share of the divine. And so none of them can hurt me. No one can implicate me in ugliness. Nor can I feel angry at my relative or hate him. We were born to work together like feet, hands, and eyes, like the two rows of teeth, upper and lower. To obstruct the other is unnatural. To feel anger at someone, to turn your back on him, these are obstructions. So what does this mean? What this means is that if you feel angry at someone or someone has wronged you, you have to recognize that you are both created by the divine First, you God, you know, the Almighty, and you need to recognize that you have the power within you from God, from the divine, to be able to recognize that this person is also part of the divine. And so there's no need for me to get angry, there's no need for me to get jealous, there's no need for me to get bitter or upset. All right, so that was our meditation for today. Just think about that. You have the power to control how you respond. You have the power to control how you act, how you behave. And that really, you want to tell the person you might be upset with or angry at or you know, whatever. You'd rather like cut from the same tree, you know? You might not be blood relatives, but you possess the same mind. And if you see the beauty of goodness and the ugliness of evil, you'll only want to do good. All right, so here's to our happy morning with Marcus Aurelius and some walking. All right, Jimmy Jacks. Okay, no, I'm kidding. You don't do anything. All right, bye-bye. Have a good morning. Have a good day.